In this question, there is this remaining word, so is remainder concept. So let's draw a bar, a bar model to show what is going on. Okay, so what we can do is let's draw a bar. Okay, so $380 is spent in January. Okay, let's put a J, A, N. Next. $430 is spent in February. And four fifth of the remaining money in March. So this is the remainder. Normally what I'll do is I'll shift the remainder down like another bar and I'll cut this into five parts. So let's see. Four fifth spent in March. March. And this is left. Okay. So next, he then found that he had only two over fifteen of the money left. So if we redraw the whole bar model which represents the total sum of money. Okay, let's draw this dotted down. This is two units left. So if this is two U and there are four boxes here, meaning that here is 8U because one box represents two units, so four boxes represent eight units. And this one is March. And we know that total we have 15 units because this is 2 over 15. So, what is this? This is 15u minus 8u minus 2u, which is equal to 5u. And 5u is 380 plus 430. So 380 plus 430, which is equals to 810. And one unit is 810 divided by 5, which is equals to 162. Find the original amount of money Mr. Tan had. So original amount of money is represented by 15 units. So it's 15 times 162, which is equals to 2430. And this is the answer.